Okay, Keith. What's up? Much time has passed. Weeks. And much has changed in our game. So what happened... I don't even know if you remember. No. No. What happened last time was... Um, I remember getting lost. Oh, wait. Are we in the sewers? Here's what happened. Okay. We went through the sewers. Okay. We went through the town after that. We went to uh, the boat. That's and and the lady showed up, and then they said that you had to go to the lighthouse. Sybil went to the amusement park. Okay. That's what everyone watching just saw. Yeah. And then we went to the lighthouse. And okay, so what happened was at the end of that episode, we were like, you know what? We should probably make sure we go and figure out how to get the best ending in the game. Mm-hmm. And we had. I went and asked eating only apples, and it turned out that we went like five minutes too far past being able to get some of the stuff some or at least see some of the cool content yep and that hour of us going to the lighthouse and going to the amusement park and everything was just total garbage and i just threw it out because you were super tired and i was in a shitty mood because we had missed our opportunity to get some cool stuff okay so i started a whole new save file I played through up to the end of the sewers. Okay. And so now we're gonna get some of the stuff that we missed. Okay. Um, I bet you were a pro at the combat. By yeah. Now. F- that's one thing I learned is that once you know how to play Silent Hill, Silent Hill is incredibly easy. So if you look at my items here, I have 16 health drinks, 10 first aid kits, two ampoules. Look at all my bullets. Have you been running away or you've been doing stuff? I've been running. Okay. I've been doing a fair amount of running. Uh, I got some of this stuff. Most importantly, I got this item. That's a red uh, liquid. Yes. Now, I can't say what it's for, even okay. though I know. But see, what this was, was when we were in the hospital, when we were still in the good hospital. Yeah. I don't know if you remember, but behind one of the desks in one of the offices was like a red liquid that had been like spilled on the ground. Mm-hmm. And you were supposed to go to the kitchen, get one of these bottles, go over and take some of the red liquid. So I Sounds did Sounds obtuse. Yeah, it's just it's just kind of one of those things you have to know how to do, or else you don't get the good ending. Okay, so that happened. All right, but man, like I did it so much faster. Can you move that bottle out of the way so that I can? Thank yeah, you. I got through the school and everything. I think in like an hour or something, or like half an hour. It was ridiculous. Yeah. Like this this save file has three hours on it. Our save file all the way through to the amusement park had eight and a half hours on it. Wow. So we're back here in the... We're back in South Park. Great. I hear there's something we're supposed to do. Yes. What we were supposed to do... Is we're supposed to go to Annie's bar. Yeah. So let's do that. So this is before we split up with... Oh, shit. It's R2, not R1. I'm going to get this so wrong. Because I've been playing a ton of Resident Evil, and Resident Evil readies your gun with the R1 button instead of the R2 oh, button. you got to get your Silent Hill game right. I'm done. This is... End this now. But, uh... Yeah, I've been having a grand old time playing uh, Resident Evil games. I heard all about that. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what's... I did, I did actually... Wait, this is not Annie's bar. No. What am I doing? I'm way north. But, uh... At first, like, when I started playing Resident Evil 2, I was like, this stupid fucking game, why did anyone think this was better than Silent Hill? But actually, I now do actually think that Resident Evil 2 is a better game. Cool. It, it definitely doesn't do, like, the horror stuff better. Like, the atmosphere in Silent Hill is awesome, but, like, the puzzles and the, like, the actual gameplay of Resident Evil 2 is way better. Yeah, this game does not have the best puzzles. This is a McDonald's of some sort. This is Burger! Yeah, I think you didn't go south like you were supposed to. I think you went, like, a little bit to the side. Yeah, you <laughs> went... Oh my god. Yeah. I was gonna say uh... something, but I was like, Kyle knows what he's doing. But I don't you know, didn't. I don't. But why is the camera like this? Stop it. Right. Oh! Shit. Okay. 
I can do this. Oh. No, no, no. Oh, Jesus. I have, I have all the controls mixed up. I just pressed circle to open my items. I am so fucked. You turned off your light. <sighs> can't use a map here. What am um, I? Kyle, <sighs> did you know that you can't use a map here? Yeah. I got this. Don't worry about it. That shotgun sounds like an air gun. Yeah. Like it doesn't yeah, that's that's the thing about Resident Evil. Way better shotgun. Oh, really? Yeah, like it actually has spread. And you can like aim upwards, so you do a thing where like when the zombies get close to you, you just point the gun up and shoot them right in the head and their head explodes. It's like the most satisfying thing in the world. This is Andy's bar though, right? For sure? No. No, it totally is. Wait. Okay, you gotta go forward and then to the left. It almost is. It's almost Andy's bar. Mm, now this is too far. No, no, it's, it's this. It's right. It's this. It's here. Uh, we made it, everybody. Don't worry. Don't worry. The w one thing you have n have not gotten better at: sense of direction. Ooh. Well, have, you, have you been in? Whoa. Here? No. All right, so you're not you're seeing new stuff too. Yeah, I I went in just long enough to see that it was a cutscene and then shut the game off. He's gonna attack by one of those demon slavs. Actually, I don't think we've seen one of those before, have we? Oh, yeah. we have, we have. Yeah, okay? the, oh no, those are the runny, jumpy yeah, guys. Yes, so. No, it's a different enemy. We actually. But I'm beat. I thought I was a goner there. So how'd it go? Did you find a way out? I think this is the guy we talked no, to at the hospital. Not yet. This is, I think okay. this is Kaufman. He's the. How about you? He runs the hospital or something. Yeah, he's the comedian that sings Mighty Mouse. Oh, God damn. But it's too soon to give up. This craziness can't go on forever. This is the thank God another human guy. Yeah. A military tried to shoot rescue us. squad should be here any time now. He said, "Did you get out? Did he mean? Town, we're home free. Did he mean? Did you get out of the hospital? Did he mean out of the hospital or out of?" The crazy world? Well, no, he meant the hospital. This isn't the time okay, but he's stand around flapping. I don't know. Are you in the hospital he, right now? He's <laughs> off. <laughs> he's off again. No. Wait. Okay. So uh, that guy's very busy. So <laughs> always needs his briefcase. Yeah. Going to meetings. I was gonna say that enemy that was is that two health drinks? Yeah. That's unprecedented. Is it? Two health drinks right next to each other? Absolutely. Yeah, no, that happens all the time. And everything. No, it doesn't. Yeah, like we found those medicine cabinets that get two health drinks right next to each other. No, they only have one. They might have wait. They might have like a kit. There would be like a kit on a desk and a health drink in the cabinet, but it's never just like two health drinks. No, because it's madness. like madness. All right, so it's. It's it's a cabinet with see-through glass windows, and the, there's two doors. So on one side there'll be a health drink, and on the other side there'll be another health drink. Nope. All right. I've played this game twice, Keith, and I edited all the video. You're gonna argue this with me? Yes. Get the fuck out of here. Okay. I mean, I'm not saying that I'm right. Well, I'm, I'm saying that you're saying wrong. <laughs> that Kaufman I'm... must have dropped this. Oh no. Oh, I got the Kaufman key. It received. I love their latest single. <laughs> Wait, no, speaking of that, have you heard the latest Passion Pit single? No. It's really good. Is it? Yeah. And I know I'm not even like a fan of them. Not like I don't like them, I just don't right. really know any of their music, but Passion Pit to me sounds like a weird it Sounds like an orgy. They like a like a mosh pit, but of people just fucking. Basically they just sound like blind melon to me. They just kinda sound like Oh, I was just actually going of what the name Passion Pit sounds like. To oh, okay. Me. I, I was I'm talking sorry. about their music. Yes, uh, yeah, well, I don't care about what music sounds like. No, go... What... Words. Keith, I pushed the flashlight button and the menu doesn't open. <laughs> 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 Worse than Resident Evil 2 indeed. Yep. Yeah. They, no, uh, well, you, you go on with what you were saying. Oh, just that Passion Pit's music sounds a lot like uh, any Blind Melon song that isn't No Rain. I don't know Blind Melon. 
A three is written. You know that song. Nope. Everybody knows that song. Say it again. No, no rain. What? All. All I can say is that my life is pretty plain. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Then yes. Oh, you mean their one song? No, they have a they have a couple. Albums. Yeah, I bet. And then their lead singer died of heroin. A, th- <laughs> a three is written on the tag. The key was thought to have been dropped by Kaufman. Thought to have been dropped by Kaufman. Have you noticed that? Like bands that Ooh. people who smoke. Ah. Uh, huh? He bought tea and paper. <laughs> and his tea cost five dollars and his paper cost twenty. Ten. <laughs> oh, that's okay, that's not a nine. I don't know. Paper would be more expensive I than tea, was right? I guess. <laughs> it totally would, right? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, seems... if you're buying a lot of paper, I mean, Kaufman has needs. He's not just buying a sheet or two. He's got those, shit to print. Those prices sound a little off. Oh, wait, you think it was toilet paper? <laughs> I, I, I don't think so. It doesn't say that. I just Kaufman's like, got shit to shit, I just, okay? I like him, like, he's so busy, he walks into a CVS, like, I need tea and paper, where is it? So, god damn it. I'll get a T. It's, it's definitely... They said the general... It's, all we know is it has a three on it. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, so Blind Blind Melon's album, Blind Melon, is all right. It's pretty good. There's there's a couple songs on there that are great, like Sleepy House. <laughs> that's a song about a, a den where people do heroin in. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah I, Sleepy House. There yeah. you go. Yeah, that's perfect. Yep. Um... Have you noticed that there's a lot of bands that like? Nope. A lot of like a like a lot of bands that go on funk tours. Funk tour, ladies. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> funk tour, ladies. <laughs> I far prefer the ladies version of funk tour. <laughs> what does that mean? That's even that's even more mysterious than. Some guy that buys paper and tea at the same store. Gah. You really got to get a handle on these controls, man. All right, so where are we going? We're going to the lakeside. No, no, no. We have to go to another place in this town, I think. Meet Barbary has in. Motel Barbary. Oh, Motel. Yeah. Yeah, so it's the key to room number three. Yeah. Nope. Oh... Bullshit. By the way, guys, I'm not illiterate. I just can't read this tiny text. Ooh, that was... No! No! Wrong button! Oh, there's two of them! Use your hammer. Oh, God, there's so many! Back, back up against the wall and use the hammer. No, because... It's too hard to... Shit! How's your health? Bad. It's too hard to, uh, to time the hammer swings with these guys, because they'll just jump right on you. Oh, shotgun. Oh, right, you have to kill... You have to do the final blow. Yep. Forgot about that. Oh, these these are probably the one of them is probably the one that you killed. Yeah, maybe going in. That's definitely possible. Oh no, you didn't kill him. You just ran away. Oh, I lied. No, I did. I shot him. Oh. Yeah. Wait, no. This no, is... right through going through the door. You. He was jumping at you, and you went inside. Oh yeah, yeah, that guy. Yeah. What? I don't know. Why am I so bad? Like, because I've been doing nothing but playing Resident Evil, so I should be super good at the, like, the tank control, looking at a map thing. Why is this giving me so much trouble? And you've played through this game twice. Well, I, I haven't, I haven't run around in this town before. Right. But, uh... Wait, use your, use your key at it. No. The door keys are automatic. Sometimes they're not, remember? No, no, we, we figured this out. It's the door keys are all automatic. Mechanism keys. 
Okay. Need to be used manually. Oh, fuck. Could you, in <sighs> three words, oh, explain what good. a mechanism key is? Okay, well, technically, all keys are for mechanisms. Yes. Lock mechanisms. <laughs> I was just going off what I said before. It was like, I said, oh, keys for... Keys for doors are automatic. Keys for any other kind of mechanism okay. are not automatic. So, like, for a chest. Or, like, a... Or for, like, a hard Like a draw, a draw bridge control. Uh-huh. Oh, I can do this. Oh, great. Yeah, that's super helpful, Silent Hill. Thanks. <sighs> I think that's a one. I was, so that's two. Two. So here's three. three. C. Yep. See what's going on in Kaufman's apartment. This is super relevant to the predicament I'm in, which is why I'm taking time to do this. I bet there's a lot of freaky porn shit. Lots of toes and stuff. Gotta get girls with nobody inside. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> like that was the thing he was looking for. Anyone in the shower? No. Oh, wait. No. Is there not? Is there something on the door? There's a note on the door. Note on the door? Oh, I do want to push the shelf. Hmm. What? Crack is too small to reach. Do I have anything that could help me with this? Yeah, guns, a knife, a hammer. Oh, by the way, this is, um... Can I read this, or is it just gonna take me outside? Yeah, great. We, we were talking about this in the in the Sonic video, but uh, I just wanted to point out that Harry Mason's inventory is a lot like those crazy video, the, like, <laughs> pocket dump videos that I was talking about. Let's see, um... I've got a bloody videotape, uh, some red liquid, this receipt, I bought paper and tea, uh, health drinks, always gotta have those on hand, first aid kit. You've never kit. seen these videos, but no. you nailed the tone. I uh, never know That's... when I'm gonna get bloody or whatever, I have an ampoule or however you say it. Um, handgun, just, you know, to defend myself, self-defense is very right. important. And um, 175 <laughs> spare rounds, just in case some bad shit goes down. Um, my back off sawed off shotgun, of course. Um, you know, some extra shells for that. And then the hunting rifle, because I'm a sportsman. Yeah. Oh, and a huge knife to cut people up. I forgot about that. And I do some plumbing, so I have a steel pipe. Wait, what do you think steel pipes are for? What? You said I do some plumbing, so I have this steel pipe. Yeah, for water to go through the pipe. I guess. What do you think pipes are for? I mean, they're for water to run through. But like, up. if I were to list a bunch of plumbing tools, I wouldn't put steel pipe on them. Like plunger. Well, I'm just saying, like, okay, if I okay. ever run into a broken pipe that needs to be fixed, okay. like, no problem. Because you've got your spare. I don't get it. So, what do I do? Try using... No, stop it, Harry. Use the pyramid thing. Yeah, perfect. That's totally gonna work. Wait, yeah, how did I not get that? Down I feel walls. like I, I carry around a broken radio and a <laughs> fucking pyramid. <laughs> and a hand axe. So, what? Yeah, I don't know. I... <sighs> It's too small to reach inside. What what do I do? Safe. I mean, I no could check in the shower, but there's nobody, nobody inside. inside, so... We could take a shower. Can you turn on the faucet for no reason, or is this not... Uh, no, George Broussard okay. uh, did not design Silent Hill, Damn. so not interactable. <sighs> this... That takes me right out of the world. No. And what's this all about? 0473. Where is that store somewhere? Can we go to that store? Oh, remember when they we learned that if you turn the light off, like enemies can't see you? Yeah. 
Let's try. I some. mean, I said that we should try Let's that. Let's try some of that. A long time ago. And then you're like, nah. But then I agreed. You have the worst memory. No. I said, do you think if I turn the light off, the enemies won't see me? And you were like, ah, do you want to try that? And I was like, no. You're like, yeah, I don't think so. I saw the video a lot because I edited it. Your impression of me is not flattering. <laughs> well, you're in. Be a more flatterable person. Ugh. The enemies still see me. Yeah, they totally still see you. Maybe if I walk, they can't. Maybe if I'm quieter. That say, Indian runner. Oh God! The moment I turn on my light, he's just like on me. Yep. You know what? That's it's probably fine. Nope. Okay, let's run. Ah, shit. O oh, four four seven seven three seven three yeah I was going with three seven well done yeah that show uh TV show the mentalist they based that off me the loathing returns. <laughs> Great. Rifle shells. Wait. Rifle shells? For hunting. Yeah. August 20th. He, he came, came by. by. I handed over the package, package that the woman, woman left here. here. September 12th. He showed, he showed up, up at Norman's, Norman's too. too. Don't, don't want to be... <laughs> <laughs> we got tripped up in the exact same place. Like, there was something about that arrangement of words that it was just like, no. Nah. Don't want to be involved with the likes of them anymore. But I'm getting creeped out even more than before. The thought of leaving town. Wait. The thought of leaving town. But are afraid of what happened if do. No. You didn't get enough out of that? <laughs> <laughs> I like to reread. I think, I think I like every to reread my favorite passages. I think every single time that there's been like a book that we needed to read, you've read it twice by accident. Or maybe it was on purpose. Yep. Maybe there's a method to my madness. It's locked. Ooh, what is this? Three loaves of bread, three cartons of milk, two dozen eggs. Rear entrance code is 0884. <laughs> what is this list? <laughs> Why Wait, no, does that the seems... grocery list also have... Oh, okay, it's deliver. Okay. It's for delivering at a place. Got deliver it. to back door, daily, 8 a.m. Rear entrance code 0886. So that's the rear entrance. Nam and Young. Nauman's grand opening. <laughs> N nom nomin? Nomin. Nomin. They get it. Don't worry about it. Open the drawer? Yes, no. Ooh. Ooh, that looks like a safe key. Sa that is. That probably goes in that safe. That key was pretty unsafe. It was just kind of hanging out. This isn't a See, door, so again, you again, gotta... it's not a door, so I have to use the key. Use the safe key. What is this? Drugs? <laughs> Do I just have like drugs? Or like mysterious substance? 
Oh, I didn't take it. You didn't any. take it, you just noticed. Mark that one more thing down on, like, what Harry what? thinks he should take or not. Like, <laughs> mysterious drugs? Nope. Blood pack? Yes. <laughs> strange chemical? Yes. No, he didn't take strange Dis chemical. Distilled water? No. <clears throat> what is... I think the funniest thing about a dystopian future or like a post-apocalyptic future is that like oh, so we go anytime around... you encounter a key, you just fucking take it. Post-apocalyptic future? Yeah. Man, you throw dark. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hit it. Hit that guy. Oh! Yes! Nailed it. Oh. Nailed him right in his stupid sloth face. Oh! I don't know why you would call this guy a sloth. They're super fast. Yeah, but they look like sloths. Duh! Every time the light goes off, I think the game's breaking. Oh, yeah, that, there was a pad. There was a pad yeah. on the door. Like, it didn't say, like, oh, there's a number pad, but it was just, like, this yeah. door is locked. But there happened to be a pad. <sighs> Come on. Yes! There we go. Awesome. <laughs> Fucking flying guy. Fucking... I can't believe that I looked up two different like FAQs for this game, and like we still, we had still to do fucking it had to figure shit out. So you fall on the FAQ side. You don't pronounce it as fac. I go back and forth. Nice. I go both ways. You say you play it by ear. I play it by ear. Took package. Told to sit on a while. Don't want to get involved, but can't disobey. He's probably linked to the death of the mayor and others. Some some really serious dude wrote that. Oh, what? Harry doesn't want a second broken radio? Yeah, I know, exactly. I was thinking that too. Like, you've been walking around with a broken radio this whole time. It's the same date as the one in the hospital. Oh my A coincidence God. that isn't a coincidence. <laughs> <laughs> Almost like dates happen for everybody. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. Like another mystery revealed about the nature of the Silent Hill universe. Oh, my God. Dates all happen the, for everybody. All the, all the newspapers in this bin are the same date. <laughs> <laughs> Investigation stalled. PTV dealers still at large. Suspicious deaths continue. Like the anti-drug mayor, a narcotics officer dies of sudden heart attack, failure, unknown origin. That was another thing I uh, wrote down, but it it's somewhere. Yeah. But um, I went to the police station when it was still like the normal, regular town, Silent Hill. Yeah. And there was just like some stuff you could read about like... Uh, Drugs like, and PTV. Yeah, it was just like about like uh, them trying to catch drug dealers and them saying like... Uh, like, the autopsy on this dead police officer said, like, he had a heart attack, but he had no prior, you know, signs of illness or whatever. Besides being a cop. Oh, uh, what? Maybe it was all the donuts. Get that thing on the Am couch. I right? A magnet? That'll probably be useful <laughs> for getting things out of holes. Oh. Magnet on a string, how convenient. Like, man, thank God there was just this magnet on a string lying around. <laughs> what? Is, who's this lady? Fuck you, Harry. It's probably Isn't like, there a look in first person mode? This, yeah, this is look in first person mode. What? Riveting. What? <laughs> this is not where he's standing. Yeah, looking first person mode needs some work in Silent Hill, I have to say. A thing that Silent Hill definitely does better than Resident Evil 2 is like uh Harry's movements. Like he, you know, like how when you turn, he kind of like 
Oh, we can his, save. His feet turn like a normal person, and he like runs up against the walls and that kind of stuff. Like the people in Resident Evil just walk like robots. Like when you turn, they just do like the animation for walking forward, but at turning. That's not a save point, you dummy. Oh. There's a guest register. Nothing special written here. Harry's suddenly like a detective. Like we've suddenly gone off on this crazy tangent where he's like trying to solve like a mystery of like the drugs. Oh uh, wait, no. Yeah, yeah, I told. All right. You were right. Fucking yeah, I was. All right. God. Keith. Yeah. Listen. What's up? You were right. Okay. Yep. Just like drop it. I'm gonna hold this over your head until the day we both die. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> That's super dark. Like, it's, it sounds like you have a specific day in mind. <laughs> and and Harry Mason's going to investigate it. Yeah. Like, the, the people who made this game were like, of course they just want to explore everywhere, right? Well, they wouldn't I mean, just go to where the game tells them to go? That's what people kind of did back then. To be fair, at that point in the game, it didn't really tell us where to go. I just happened to know that... No, we're supposed to go to the lighthouse. No, but it didn't say go to the lighthouse. Oh, okay. I just happened to know that Silent Hill eventually goes to the lighthouse, so I was like, well, that's where we're going. Oh, okay. I let the pressure of people telling me that I should run from enemies get to me, so instead of, like, investigating through the town and killing the enemies, I just went like, ah, enemies, and, like, ran away. Now I have a motorcycle key, of course. Motorcycle Why would I not have a... Why would somebody put a mo uh, motor? Why would someone wait? Hold on! Key? Don't pretend like that's not ridiculous. Why would somebody put a motorcycle key in a hole in the ground in a hotel room underneath a dresser? Why would someone motorcycle key? Motorcycle. Can we think of? Does this game as a vehicle section? Can we think of any motorcycles that didn't motorcycle? What the f what? I didn't see a motorcycle. Am, are we just the two most blind people in the world? I mean, there's definitely not a motorcycle here, right? I'm not crazy. Right? Maybe everything's motorcycles. And there's no motorcycle there. But... Uh, inside me? Like, inside the motel? Something? I don't know. You think there might be a motorcycle showroom that we missed? Yeah. If it's anything, it's exactly that. It's a motorcycle showroom. You should walk in like, somebody here really liked motorcycles. Motorcycles? Who would... Why would somebody... Why would somebody... Put a motorcycle... Who could even... What? Well, I don't... Wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> There's gotta be... I was thinking about it. Yeah? Actually, as I was replaying this game... I realize there are wheelchairs in like a bunch of other locations throughout the game. And like at the very beginning there's like a wheelchair and there's like a a table. There's like a gurney from the hospital, but it's like right at the beginning and stuff. Like there must be something with the wheelchair later on in the game. All right, go, these, go these wheelchairs the aren't office. for nothing is what I'm saying. Yeah. I'll use the motorcycle key on this thing. What is this thing? What is ashtray. that? Ashtray. A stand-up ashtray next to a couch? What? Yeah, people sit down and smoke. And, it takes place then, in the 80s. But then need an ashtray that's way higher than where Try they're that sitting? Motorcycle gas thing. What is this? I don't know. Oh, that's the thing that we... That's a journal. Keep reading those. Harry Mason's always reading journals. Reading newspapers, reading journals. Uh, go get, talk to the TV and the thing next to the TV. You think this might be a motorcycle? Yeah. <laughs> There's a TV set. Power must be out. It doesn't work. It says... Do you want me to read what it says? I decided to throw my phone before no, I, I read it. Want you, oh, here's a motorcycle. Oh, great. This looks like a motorcycle. It looks just like a motorcycle. Just like it. This looks like some shotgun shells, so let's get some of those. It's oh. a health drink. Weird. 
because that health drink totally looked like shotgun shells. Batteries, oil cans, other items line the shelves. None of these would be useful in my mind. Me being Harry Mason. Yeah, that That's is weird. That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> the things that he finds Wait, weird. The dust is wiped away around the gas cap. Probably get that gas. Oh, I need some health. Good thing you have every health drink. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh, remember we found a rock drill, but it was out of gas, and we're like, hey, if we ever need to drill some rocks, let's get some gas. Why am I doing this? I don't know. Like, in his mind, <laughs> what like this... What? Yeah, of course. Did you take it? Kaufman's not going to be pleased Give me about that. this. What is this? That's none of your business. For someone... I forgot, in the intro cutscene that we skipped over... How yeah? coming up with a way to get out of here? It showed Kaufman arguing with, uh... You shouldn't be hanging around here goofing off. What do you think you're with doing? With Lisa. It kind of set him up as looking like a killed? bad person. Get out of here. Okay, take it easy. Unless you want to die, keep your mind on business. Oh. Got it? For someone whose life you've saved twice... Keep your mind on business, like shooting crazy pterodactyls and whatever. That guy's got to be involved with Man, he rat. was pissed. I guess I wasted my time. Oh, yeah, he's going for his... <laughs> Wait, get the, gas, get the gas can. See if you can. Yeah, it's gas... Gas? No. Nah. Yeah, like he's trying to save his daughter. But he's like, let's check out this motorcycle. What is going So there's no vehicle section in this game. Did you think there might be? Only in that joke. Oh, okay. Let's go up here. Let's walk up this. Come on. Fine. So that's that's the last thing to do in the side quest. Yep, that's it. Harrowing. Barely. Harrowing. All right, let's get back to uh, where we need to be. So that's the dumb thing we needed to do in order to get the good ending. I enjoyed it. Yeah, but it didn't really make sense. It was kind of fun. Yeah. Finding out more about... drug... stuff. I don't know. He's gaining on you. Nah. Let's see if this helps me out. Going straight anyways. There's some weird screaming going on in the ambient music. There's some cutscenes. Serious going on. loading happening. Yeah. What's this? Yeah, this thing. Now the worlds have blended together permanently or something. I don't know. I don't know. <clears throat> no doubt something terrible is going on. No doubt. I had doubts before, but now there is no <laughs> doubt. <laughs> Great. Man. 
Yeah, it might be harder for enemies to see with your light off. Mm -hmm. Not the most fun way to play this game. Just in the dark, pressing forward. But I'm kicking ass. That's what's important. There are a whole mess of enemies around here. But none of them are following me. So I'm kicking true. ass. Oh! Except for when you run right into a bird. Yeah, well, whatever. Right? Yeah. Whoop. No, no, no. Goodbye. Yeah. Boom, boom. Sybil. Harry. How did you get back here? I followed the sewer. Were you the one who cut the fence? I'm glad you made it. I was worried about you. You were worried? Where did you disappear to? Never mind. I want to know what's going on here. What is with this town? Oh, right. This may sound really off the wall, but oh. <laughs> you've got to believe me. I'll, I'll say this: like, I haven't gone crazy. I'm not. Resident around. Evil 2's voice acting. At first, I thought I was losing. Was a mind. lot better. Yeah. But also, like, now the goings on of the story was like so much it's more boring. Me. This whole town. Like, I just wanted to skip every cutscene, and it wouldn't let me. That's a world of someone's nightmarish delusions come to life. Little by little, the invasion is spreading. I wonder if he realizes that there's a way to explain this that doesn't sound as crazy. I don't know about, about that. Harry, hold on a minute. I don't get it. I don't get it? I don't get it? I don't understand it all myself. <laughs> I guess I can't explain There's it. a bit you don't understand, Harry. Well, what's making this happen? I just... I can't... I don't know that either. <laughs> I do know Cheryl is there. There? I would love and to see air quotes there, like them actually do the... Cheryl I know is Cheryl is there. Needs my help. You said the exact same thing the last time. Because I would love it. <laughs> Thing's been a major I hate that. To you. That's, I think that's like a glitch with you playing PS1 best. games on a PS3. I haven't encountered it. I don't remember it happening. It happened on the Overblood 2 the Super TV Replay. Awakening, spreading those wings. Who knows, because that game is busted as hell. Dahlia Gillespie. I'm going to stand here creepily. I see it all now. Yes, everything. Hungry for sacrifice, the demon will swallow up the land. I knew this day would come. And what's more, the task is almost finished. I don't know. There's something about the way that Silent Hill is left. that it makes me feel like the, the people that the seem evil and like big jerks of are probably the only ones that aren't. When it is completed, oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure Dahlia is not evil. Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if she Kaufman just also has. Does. It's just like the sun. The dead will walk and martyrs will burn. It's really just like the of lack of direction for the voice Everyone acting. Will die. You know, it's just kind of like yeah. you're a so crazy old lady. Say these crazy things, and she's like, I don't know. Okay, I'm just gonna say them like I'm crazy. Like that's kind of all they really had there, I guess. And the demon taking that child's form. Alessa. Stop it before your daughter. Alessa or Alyssa? Alessa. Alessa. Before it is too late. 
Um. Stop it! Stop it! What do I do? Go to the lighthouse on the lake. And to the center of the amusement park. Make haste. You are the only hope. Look, Harry. I really don't get what's going on. But if there's a chance we can save your daughter, I'm in. I'll check out the amusement park. You go to the lighthouse. Though... Sybil, thanks. Thanks. Yeah, whatever. Maybe the first horror genre thing was to split to people it. up. Use like the first time that happened. Strength in numbers. Only with that can you Scooby Doo, probably. Probably Scooby Doo. They yeah. did it first. They did it first. And really, they did it. They did it the best. I don't think they did it first because when they, when they did in Scooby Doo, it was no, very tongue in cheek. Of course not. Well, Scooby Doo's been around for a long time. That's. I wouldn't be surprised if you thought that. I know you might not have. Uh, you might not have sensed the the joke in my words there because I am a very serious person. You're a straight man. That's true. 